Do you want me to carry you into bed tonight? I felt like someday when I was strong enough that I would want to get a broiler chicken and give it the best life I could for as long as I could and educate other people about broilers. You want to go night, night Yeah. One day I saw a Facebook post from somebody I know and they had just picked some up from Tractor Supply. That's me, love you. Love you. I was instructed that they needed to be processed um, on their 56th day. That was the time that I was supposed to slaughter this little chick before he ran into all the issues of being a broiler. so completely in love with him. <laughs> I'm gonna pet you. Oh, I pet you. Hi, buddy. Hi, bud. Uh-oh. Well, who's coming to get me because I'm petting you? He learned his name so quickly like a dog would in a day. He was so happy just to be with you. He didn't like cows, though. So, Fatty, must I remind you It was always such a hard word for me because I felt like his heart never ever once failed him. His heart, it beat three years, three years, more than it was intended to. He woke up, he listened to his music, he washed his feet, he had breakfast, he had his medication. He looked great. As I was about to walk by him to go get something, his just his head kind of flopped to the side. I ran to him and I picked him up in my arms and one hand was sort of on his chest holding him up and holding him to me. I could feel the moment that his heart stopped and he was gone. You're such a good boy, Pepe. We love you. We love you.